On May 13th, students from several universities left Kansas on a two-month journey in, to Washington, D.C. to save the Wakarusa wetlands, Lawrence's only remaining indigenous wetland prairie, from becoming the South Lawrence Trafficway. They carried with them the Protection of Native American Sacred Places Act, a draft piece of legislation which will protect sacred places. The wetlands adjoin Haskell Indian Nation University and have been used for ceremony, prayer, and education since Haskell's founding as a boarding school in 1884. Prompted by the proposed highway construction through the wetland, the students traveled 21 days on the 1838 Potomotomy Trail of Death route to show appreciation to the community's maintaining markers of remembrance. The draft piece of legislation the students carried, which has been approved by the National Congress of American Indians, would amend the American Indian Religious Freedom Act of 1978 to provide a right for action for protection of Native American sacred places, such as the Wakarusa wetlands. The students called the journey the Trail of Broken Promises, and on June 28th they ended their walk at the White House, yet their journey continues, and on July 10th they will meet with Kansas Senators Roberts and Morin. For more information on how you can help with this journey, you can visit tobp2012.webs. Com. And that's another roundup of news from Indian Country on this edition of the Native News Update. I'd like to thank you for joining me and have a grand day.